What's happening, YouTube, and welcome back to the Scott Attempts Gaming Channel for a brand new FIFA 23 player career mode video. So we're finally into the January transfer window, and we have a game on January the 1st against Arsenal. Now, I'm going to show you something which is going to absolutely blow your mind. Arsenal are 13th in the league table. At the halfway point, won five, drawn five, lost nine. Minus four goal difference, 20, 29 goals conceded. In real life, at the time of recording, Arsenal are top of the Premier League. So something has gone monumentally wrong at the Emirates. They're only four points clear of the drop zone at the halfway stage. We start today sixth in the Premier League, and I'm really impressed the fact that we're actually in and around play, uh, the Champions League places. If you watch the last video, you'll know there are eight teams at the minute who, who could get into the Champions League places. It's literally so, so tight in the top half of the Premier League. Despite Arsenal's lowly league position, this is not going to be an easy game. Uh, the Emirates not an easy place to go. But Bolton in the past have had success over Arsenal, and we have managed to beat Arsenal so far in this career mode. Lads, I've just had a look at the lineup then before the game started and it looks like we have signed a new player uh joe rawls from cardiff city has signed for us yeah that's pretty weird so we've got an, he's 70 rated so it's like a 70 rated midfielder and he actually captains the team today so right snowy day at the emirates arsenal gonna get us on the way and ketia getting the game started now arsenal as we know struggling you have to beat the out form teams if you want to get into the champions league places the ball one more we're in lads what a start this could be oh what a start what a finish our literal first attack of the game leads us to scoring one nil it's a great ball by family a really really good timing on the run to stay on side and it's just passed into the bottom corner past former bolton academy player aaron ramsdale and arsenal's misery looks like it's going to continue all that come from just a poor shot on the edge of the box from an arsenal player and we could attack again here Famier gets into a good position. Whipped in, Famier. It's 2 0. No way, it's 2 0 inside 10 minutes. Ramsdale with an absolute howler. Celebrating with the Bolton away travelling fans. Wow. Well, here's the replay. Let's get, get the better of Sangara on the wing. Passed it across the floor. And it's a big owl of that from Ramsdale. It's straight at him. He should be saving it. And Famier puts us 2 0 up at the Emirates. It's, oh, it's a big, big mistake that from Ramsdale. Two attacks, two goals, lads. What an opening 10 minutes. And Arsenal are really, really struggling. It's a good ball for Eddie and Ketia. He is away. Oh, he's got past his man, and he's run it out for a goal kick. What's he doing? And Ketty has got himself into an excellent position and just passed it out for a goal kick. What's that? Chance here. Oh, we're away again. Sadly, uh, could be free. Oh, he's, he's, that was a poor finish. Literally hit it straight at Ramsdale. That was a really nice move again from us. Oh, Pamier, well done. Got to be free. What a terrible finish. Is that George Johnston who that I fell to then? Does he pass it straight into the keeper's hands? It's going to be 2 0 at half time, lads. What a first star performance from us today. Absolutely blew Arsenal away in the first 10 minutes. And it's just been annihilation since then. I think they might have brought Gabriel Jesus on. Yeah, they have. Oh, it's a lovely play by Udegaard. And Gabriel Jesus is in. And Arsenal have one back. It's 2 1. Jesus making an instant impact for Arsenal. A really good play by Odegaard there. Skipping past his man and playing Jesus in. Does really, really well. Lovely through ball. In goes Jesus. Excellent finish from the edge of the box. And Arsenal are back in it now. Chance. Oh, what a save by Ramsdale. He's making up from that earlier mistake. Whipped in. Near post. Free header. 3 1 to Bolton. What an header. And it's Clint Lehmans who gets on the score sheet. It's a beautiful delivery right onto the six yard box. And it's a gorgeous header from Clint Lehmans. Restores our two goal lead. It's 3 1 to Bolton. If results go against Arsenal today, they could find themselves one point above the relegation zone. Let's find out exactly who. Alex Scott. Good ball. That's okay. Everyone back. Oh my god, Paul Pogba scores for Arsenal, and it's 3-2. Excellent move by Arsenal. Gabriel Jesus with the assist. He has been uh, magnificent since he's come on, honestly. He's made a massive difference. It's a great ball to Pogba. Edge of the area. Toll's got to get across a bit quicker. Right into the corner. Game on. 3-2. And a lot of time left in this game as well. Oh, let's say it goes. Great ball by Udegaard. Got to... Toll's not got there. Oh, what an interception by Rodrigo. He's, it is our star man, isn't it, Rodrigo? That's actually a good ball. 
Oh my god, it's free. Oh, no way. Oh, Pogba equalises for Arsenal. We've thrown it away, boys. Oh, no. That is a great ball over the top, to be fair. It's a lovely touch. Oh, well. Pogba, Pogba and Gabriel Jesus have made the difference today. Oh, you've got to pass me the ball. Have a shot. Oh, what a save by Ramsdale. What a game of football you've been treated to here, boys. Free all. Pogba. Oh, he's blocked. Keeper. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Lads were literally hanging on here. And it finishes free all with Bottle, a two-goal lead in the second half. To be fair, lads, excellent game of football. And on paper, a point away at Arsenal is not a bad result. We've took four points off Arsenal this season. Wow. I don't know what to say, boys. What an unbelievable second half of football that was. So we finished the game of an 8.3 match rating, one goal, two assists. Joel Famier getting a goal and an assist, and Clint Lehman's getting on the score sheet with a goal. A lot of red performances there. Fat 6, 5.8, 5.9. Yeah, that's not good enough. The draw keeps us sixth in the division, but it does open a three point gap between Spurs and ourselves. And up next for us is table topping Manchester United, and what I would give. To beat Manchester United. So it is Derby Day, boys, at the Uniball. Bolton versus Manchester United. Let's please, please beat these. So it's here, lads. Derby Day, the big one. Manchester United at the Uniball. Now, remember, Manchester United beat us 3 1 pretty easily in the last time we played them. I'm going to do a deal with you, lads. If we beat Manchester United now, you've got to subscribe to the channel. You've got to sub. United get us on the way in that di disgusting lime green kit. Victor Oshiman. Weston McKenney, Bruno Fernandes, Urian Timber. What a side United have got. Back defending lads already. Oh my god. Ref, that's a red card. That's a red card, ref. It's got to be a red card. It's from behind. He just took me out. Of course. Of course he didn't get red carded. Oh, put it back. Oh my god, come on. We're in, lads. Oh, what a save. No. No, where's he to save that? Is that David De Gea, that? Are they still getting... Well, I'm going to say. No, no, no. It's good football from United. Anthony. Great ball to Alfonso Davis. Oh, it's cut back to Anthony. 1-0 Man United. Oh, that is such a good goal from United. What can you do about that? All starts from a brilliant ball by Anthony. Wide to Davis. He gives it Anthony back. That is a stunning finish by Anthony. Fair play. Right into the top bag. Third play. Excellent goal. Joel Ref. That's another foul. Now shot happy oh, here. that was flying. That was absolutely to flying. To oh, here we go. There's Oshiman's in. It's too easy. Center. What a save, Rodrigo. Oh, oh, oh my God. It should be two. Really. It's looking promising. Three from here. One one. Brilliant goal. That's more like it, lads. That is more like it. Great run down the way. Look at that pace. Passed everyone. Pulled back to Famia. He's not missing from there. Right into the corner. Beautiful finish from Joel Famia. David De Gea, no chance this time. One one. It's game on. Anthony, we need to try and keep him a bit quieter. Look at our stamina bar already. I want it there, though. But I'm saying, Famier, it's 2 1. What a goal! Joel Famier is on absolute fire today. Lads, we have turned it round against Manchester United. Top of the table, Manchester United, may I add. Flip flat. Flat had done too much though. What a cross that is right onto the six yard box. Famier gets in front of his man and just powers it into the bottom corner. Oh, see you later, Anthony. <laughs> and lads, we are 2 1 up against Manchester United at half time. Joel Famier brace, two assists for us after Anthony's stunner in the opening 10 minutes. A nice shot. Oh my god. I thought that were going to nest, so I thought it were nestling, lads. Oh, it's decent to be fair. Oshiman, that's a great ball back to Re Nildo. The rest of that. Stop the cross, lads. Good block. Well played. Oh, it's a short corner again. Stay with your men. Get to him. No, 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 no. Good save, Rodrigo. United having all the ball in the last couple of minutes. Sancho. Well cut out again by our defenders. Wow. Oh, it's giveaway. McKenna. Sancho is in. 
Is it the bar? Oh my god, Sancho misses a huge chance for Man United. One on one with a goalkeeper, Sancho hits the crossbar. Is it going to be our day today? Give the ball away again, Graven Birch up to Washington. United are getting in behind a bit too much. That is a superb ball. And Sancho's offside. He's offside, he's offside. Flick that on and we're in. We're in. What a flick on by Famier. Watch this, De Gea. Chipped. Oh, he saved it. No, I thought I dinked him. Oh, what if I dinked De Gea? Corner, come on. We're good from these. Free header. Oh, that's an easy catch. Get away from our two men. Great ball. Eugene is in. Another great ball. Finish. Oh, no. Is it straight at the goalkeeper? No. Out. What an interception. No. What a save, Rodrigo. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. What are they doing? The keeper's forward. Come on against United. Come on. Win the header. Over it comes. Good save. Throw it. Throw it. Throw it. Is that of his net? Is it in? No. Oh, he got back just in time. And that's gonna be it, lads. We're gonna beat Man United. We beat Man United, lads. 2-1 to Bolton. What a win that is. Rodrigo coming clutch there with some huge shaves in that second half. And we finally beat Manchester United. So an absolutely incredible win against Tabletop and Man United. Two assists for us. Two goals for Joel Famier. What a performance. A game that I'll be remembered for a long, long time. So, lads, we do now have eight skill points available. I'm going to see what to put them into. I'm not really too sure. I'm not going to do anything on defending. Put one more into... I could have 95 ball control, to be fair. Let's put one more into ball control. That takes us to 95 ball control. Let's get this cheater archetype. Give us even more pace. We're now a 92 acceleration, 95 sprint speed. We have two more skill points. I'm going to put them both into free kick accuracy. So, now we have 85 free kick accuracy. You might be wondering why we don't get many shooting chances from free kicks. I really, really want to score a free kick in this career mode, like, really, really badly. I haven't scored a free kick on this FIFA yet, so that is the thought process behind that. We now have, this is, we're 85 overall, wow, 94 pace, 86 shooting, 78 passing, 89 dribbling, 36 defending, 72 physical, acrobat, architect, finisher, and cheater archetypes, wow, what a player we are. And you know what that means, lads? Request the wage increase. Come on. 23.5k a week. I wish I was on that in real life. Up next, lads, is a cup tie against Brighton, the FA Cup. I'm going to simulate this one, lads. I'm much more focused on the league at the minute. Uh, I'd like an FA Cup run. But I'm just gonna, I am just haven't actually simulated a single game this season. That's why the career mode's moving so slowly. I'm going to simulate it. I, we might beat them. You never know. And we have drawn with Brighton. We got on the score sheet. Undav pulled one back in the 82nd minute. It will go to a replay. And I do fancy us at home with home advantage. We might just get the win against Brighton. So a quick glance at the league table, lads. Liverpool, United, top of the league, top of the pile. They're not going to be caught this season. Spurs and Man City occupying the other top four places. We sit in fifth, uh, two points off the top four. Obviously, Man City have got a much, much superior goal difference than us. Chelsea and Leicester are breathing down our necks as well. Look to our next game. We are playing Fulham, who are 14th in the league. They've already beat us once this season, so revenge would be good. Before then, though, it's this replay against Brighton. Obviously, this is going to get simulated again. Let's see if we can win and get through to the fourth round. And we managed to beat Brighton due to a second Eugenie on the score sheet. We get a 6.9 match rate and not the best. We are through to the fourth round of the FA Cup. One thing I have noticed as well, lads, is we've not had any bids come in for us yet. So it looks like Bolton are no longer looking to sell us, which is exactly what we want to see. Lads, I've just seen something. Let's look at this. Let me show you something. We have been drawn against Manchester United at home again. Wow, you could not write it, could you? Man United three times in one season. Anyway, it's time for Fulham at home. Let's try and get revenge when we got from when we got beat at Craven Cottage. So, win today, lads. And we could be back in the Champions League places. This is why these games are so important against the lesser teams. Last time out, we beat Man United. So, we should be full of confidence. And hopefully, we can overturn that loss to Fulham at Craven Cottage. Great ball. Famier's in. Oh, he doesn't pass ever. He's so bad at that, Famier. Oh, what? oh the touch is terrible. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Go for a shot. Oh, that's a great save. We've got a chance to get out, follow me here. 
Oh, see you later, Sally Sue. See you later, lad. Let's get a goal. What a finish. Sent him to the shops and put it into the top corner. I like this. Let's get past Sally Sue. So is he. He overcommits. Ball roll past him. That is an absolute scotcher into the top corner. Keepers. No keeper in the world is saving that. 1 0 to Bolton. We managed to use that pace as well. Like 95 sprint speed. 92 acceleration. Wow. No one is catching us. Famia will give the ball away here, I'm sure. Play me, Famia, please. He's. Lads, come on. Santos, that's yours. Well played. Defence has been really, really good. And that's half time. 1 0 to Bolton, lads. Actually, a good half. Uh, there's only been one real chance all game, and it's gone in. And Fulham will get us on the way for this second half. But as we saw in the Arsenal game, games can just completely change. One goal changes a game. This is a chance, this. Oh, pass Alisu again. They've got his number, lads. It's too easy to get past him. And it might be. That's 2-0. Sally Sue is having an absolute stinker. We've done him twice with the exact same move, and it's 2-0 to Bolton. So easy to get past him. There's one ball roll. Composure. Bang. Smack past the goalkeeper. 2-0. Two goals. Two of the exact same goals. And we could now be heading back into the Champions League places. Good ball. When the header. Oh, no. Big defending that. Let's get past Martinez. The pass in. Hat trick. Oh, what a save. We have more live Premier League action coming up for Famier. Lads, just watch Famier. Right, what I'm going to do soon is just put all a compilation of Famier just losing the ball. He couldn't finish, he'd be the worst player at the club by far. 85 on the clock, lads. It looks like we're not going to bottle this one. That's actually a. No, it's what's too soon, Rodrigo. Rodrigo. He's the best, one of the best keepers in this division. I'm telling you now. What? what? Why did you stand there? Rodrigo again. Clear it. And it's a 2-0 win versus Fulham. Excellent, excellent performance. Rodrigo once again stepping up, saving us when we need him. Two goals on the counter-attack per play. 2-0, excellent. 8.8 .8 match rating, two goals for us. An assist for Correa and George Tomasson. What a performance. Are we back in the top four? Let's go and find out. Just in case you're wondering why the highlights for this game were so little, that's why there were two highlights in the full game. And that win takes us up to fifth, level on points with Spurs and Manchester City, all on 40 points. Wow, look how tight it is in the race for the top four. That will go right down to the wire, lads, I'm 100% certain. If you have enjoyed this video, please make sure you hit the like and subscribe button as it really lets me out, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.